Docker is useful for microservices, you know that. Docker, with help of Docker, you can install any MySQL server, anything you can do, image and, but, <coughs> but PMM will do. Let me increase some size, okay. Sudo hyphen I. Done. Fine. Now, I first install Docker. From once Docker has been installed, pull the server, whatever you want to do that. It contains, I think, one GB. I think so. We'll see how much time it will take. Okay, reboot the server. Okay, uh, Docker, install Docker. In different, different methods, you can go with ESA and all those things. But a lot of people are using, I've been discussed with some of the, my students also, they're using Docker only. That method we are going to install. Okay, Docker installed. Pull the PMM server. Parcona PMM. This is the <clears throat> version two. Version one also is there, but we are not using version two. We are using pull that Docker. Docker image. Okay, okay. See, 500 MB is there. It completely, the comp uh, complete, once it is installed, the server um, more than 1.5 GB PMM server will be there. Most of the company, which monitoring tool this they one, are using? This one only. I have uh -huh. this one. Uh -huh. okay. In my organization, one of my two, three students are there. They are also saying this tool only because okay. some companies are using completely open source databases like Postgres, Mongo, right? Mm -hmm. If you go with PMM monitoring system, no need of going for another uh, monitoring tools. Okay. If this PMM will be helping you. Main thing, if something happened, <clears throat> okay, it has to trigger to your email, mailbox mm -hmm. also. This will help you. Okay. Then what is the, then nobody won't use paid tools, right? But services, mm -hmm. they'll be charging. And uh, for software, it is free. Okay. The main repository wherever we check all whatever you serve whatever you want suppose because we can't start all servers if you have some good capacity or if you want to go with aws right install the same system in aws machines you can add number of whatever you have the servers you can add and you can test it we'll do we'll do one or two databases we'll try to do that okay 
better we'll go with any uh, we have replications also right but we can't go with three four this server will hang my uh, means my laptop will hang yeah. can't one or two databases three data three servers we can do at a time we'll see mm -hmm. Uh, these things, uh, Docker and all, that is a AW, sorry, DevOps uh, concepts. One of the, in that, Docker is one of the service they have to know that because DB is not required just for uh, PMM. You can go with that, just Docker install. On top of that, you can install any image, even MySQL server also, you can do that. But normally, yes, they won't. Monitoring the tool. That uh -huh. You can monitor and you can write in that monitoring alerting system smtp add that smtp server and mm -hmm. uh, email dls whatever is dls dba group or any other groups are there add that groups and if something happened immediately it will trigger that immediately we will take action okay like that that is the benefit of monitoring tool is to say what is happening day to day right that is the reason we can't monitor mm -hmm. suppose i have uh, okay let me i have some around left side you can see around uh, uh, 10 i'm not sure 10 or more than 10 plus 10 plus daily i cannot log into the server i can't see that right if i see every day log into one server means every day this only this will happen that's it for that reason just create one monitoring system from there you can monitor anything if anything happen it will trigger to you you can do whatever you want for 10 systems only we are can't daily we can't log in if you have 50 100 like that some servers we have 300 400 also will be there mm. okay it is almost completed and then okay uh, <clears throat> downloaded new image you have to create the whatever you have this you have to create a volume for data directory and this bin this is the bin for this extracting once extracted right now, what is the size of 500 MB? Once it is extracted, it comes under 1.5 GB, I think so. Yeah. Once installed, no, I'm not sure. MB test complete internally the size will be 1.5 okay. downloaded the new image suppose if you want to see only one image it is there see the size of uh, 1.8 1. GB we have the image ID is something it is saying image ID and five it has been created five weeks ago means they updated with five weeks ago it has been updated so daily it will give the created and it will change that <coughs> okay now use create a volume not this one Okay, it is generated C file something and 
this is the c attached restart always sunway this is the published timing time every 90 something timing also is there it will publish with pmm name data volume and all those things <coughs> and this is the testing it is done actually in the simple method only it is done see admin username admin password admin if once if you give in this it will display it has to display what is the version and the server everything it has to display like this uh, yes I think it is working fine. Let me see. Uh, you can stop PMM server. You can do that. Already it is running. Stop and start. Okay, stop and start. Stop. Okay, start. fine here let the browser take the browser because you this browser will be helping out to in your external network also in your laptop net browser also it will open but we need to give a lot of settings okay uh, here nothing to local lot of changes we need to do what happened not secure see parcona management tool this will be uh it will be helpful to open this one but the thing is i think it won't open admin admin logged in why whatever okay confirm it's a new password okay new password i'm giving some welcome something like that submit no i'm just skipping let me i've been skipped browser not fully supported okay yeah, this browser right that is not our job they'll be doing but we'll do browser will update I'm not uh, what to uh, see first uh, Firefox version C. Firefox iPhone iPhone version. What? <clears throat> I think a very low version it is there. APT get update. This is general this is not a we installed successfully get install firefox yes let me see that browser is not up to date that is the reason that URL is not opening. You can open that in your external browser, but you have to set IP addresses and all those things. That is not uh, <clears throat> our job. That is the reason I'm showing in this one. If you know the concept, wherever it will, no problem, right? That is IP address, what you have to keep it in your host. You have to keep IP address on top of that IP address you have to verify whether that ip address is pinging in your local network that that you can do uh, firefox regular uh, running as a root in uh, is not supported which is owned by oh, let me
yeah 83 now will open <coughs> we have to close it and we have to open now you can okay this environment also changed <coughs> okay you can if you log in admin password also admin because they have been given default of new password we can skip it without password also we can go we'll see what will happen <coughs> okay save it yeah this is the monitoring tool yes got it parkona monitoring and management tool see monitoring node is one internally that is running we have what is this information about this info only one server information it is pmm server is running how much space nine point sorry this memory is uh, nine two gb i given right that is the thing everything it is giving the info about that now i want to add in a number of uh, things whatever you want to see these services mysql nodes <clears throat> postgres instances and here you can click it if you want to monitor for first time right it is taking time loading time and all those things we have given only 2 gb for this one no instances just it is see what you can monitor minimum my sql uptime maximum uptime and buffer pool size everything connections connection details what are the connections you have because we don't have right now about that connections i will add tomorrow monday i will add just for today i will close the links 